Hey, what is going on, guys? Today I'll be commentating over a new and a 63 gun streak on hijack that I got. It was against boss, but it was regular bots, so I mean, it wasn't that bad of a gameplay for me because I just got the game. And it was with the MP7 on BO2, if you didn't know what the game was. But it was a pretty good gameplay. And today, while I'm going to be commentating over this, I'll be talking about how the pub summoning community really isn't that, like, toxic and stuff. Like, I've had more toxic communities that I've been in. Like, the Rust community, that community is, like, 20 times more toxic than the pub summoning community. Like, the pub summoning community is not toxic at all. Like, it's like the Minecraft community or something like that. Like, nobody's really that toxic. Like, I, I would say the Minecraft community could be more toxic than them pub summoning community because the pub summoning community is super nice like there's a lot of nice people in this community and like i've met a bunch of friends in this community i just don't understand why people say it's so toxic like some call of duty communities are but like the one we're in like the pub summoning community this community is not really toxic at all like, like some games have more toxic people than others but i'd say call of duty really doesn't have many toxic people in it like i don't understand where people are getting the fact that the kai community is toxic or something like it's really not toxic like the community is great and i just don't understand like there's so many nice people in the community like Sionis, he's such a legend he's one of the nicest people i've met in the cog community same with wolfie but he's not really in the cog community but he's a really nice guy that i've met same with even tepex zero or rush zero whatever you want to call him i just call him tepex zero because that's when i met him when he was in tepex he's such a nice guy too like i met him through the pub summoning community like He's one of the nicest people I've met. Like the other day, me and Zero played some CSGO with each other. Like we've never even met or talked in real life before. But we just played some CSGO together and it's pretty fun. Like I'm not that good at all, but he's pretty good at the game. So I mean, it was a bit of a difference because I was pretty bad and he was pretty good. So I mean, if we played like Black Ops 2, I may be better. But like same with Psionics. Like I play with him with CSGO and stuff. And, and I'm not that good at all, but I still play with him, and he doesn't care really how good I am at all. It's just for fun, but, like, the community is not bad at all. Like, I'm trying to emphasize that if you're scared to join the pub summoning community because you hear it's, like, a bad community or something, that's completely incorrect. Like, this community is such a good community, I don't care what other people say, it's just, it's just a good community. Like, I've been in it maybe for a year now, and I've realized it's not that bad of a community at all. And I don't care what people say. Like, some people in the community do get salty sometimes. But there's not many people in the community that actually are salty all the time and just annoying like that. Like, there's only maybe two people I've met that have been like that. And I'm not going to say names or anything. But I don't talk to them anymore at all. Because I just don't want to be associated with them. Because, like, they have people's YouTube channels and stuff. And, like, the pub summoning community. And I know somebody that their channel has been hacked by this person before. But... Like, it's pretty stupid, some of the people in the community. But this gameplay's wrapping up, so I'm gonna leave you here with the rest of the gameplay to watch. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.